34 years in Orlando. Uh, we couldn't wait for the other uh, guys to say I grew up in Florida. Most of it was in Orlando. Most my uh, elementary and kid years. Yeah. Uh, moved to Georgia for a short three years, and then I moved to graduate high school from Maryland. Here we go. <laughs> Oh, because I have a friend that graduated from Coco, and, and well, uh, I was going to Coco until I built my My senior year, I was going to Coco. Wow. Well, you would have missed him to see him younger than us. Yeah. Uh, he would have been before you. Yeah, Kim Wood, who graduated from um, uh, Coco. Okay. But um, our dearest friends in Orlando, the one that reigned from Orlando, he was born in the range from Orlando. He was born in the range from Orlando. He was born in the Oh, yes, yes. Well, when, that we, when we first integrated in Gary's idea and loved it, and then uh, uh, 33rd Street now is the uh, the, the, uh, the lock-up. Everyone in town is 33rd Street. That's its thing. 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 That's Yep, we got backpackers. We have to take halfway and drop off. Yep, we have. Yep, we got backpackers up halfway, and then we'll have to pick them up when we get back. Maybe I don't know. Huh? It is. Yeah, it's real cool. Because this is coal fired engines. Yeah. Coomers and Toltec is coal fired. About three blocks away where my elementary school was. We had 10 foot cycle engines with barbed wire on the top. And I used to walk the sky. It was no big deal. But it didn't rise. And that whole, that's why I didn't think you could find it. That whole area is totally in shape. Torn everything down nearly there. And I say 33rd Street, that's where they go to the block. It's a huge block. Well, you know, by now, it might have been. That was probably. Maybe it's gone now. Maybe yeah. we just, you know, we saw so many changes in Orlando in the first few years we were there. My feeling is actually, that's why we chose Orlando, because they were going to come down. Cars are going to be rocking for a while, so get ready. Hold on tight, we're going to 
going to start rocking in a few minutes. You guys ever been to Gunnison, Colorado? Yeah, that's right near Gunnison. Yeah, yeah. Because if you go to Gunnison, the 268 Bumblebee's there, the C16. The same steamer like this one, but smaller. Like their RGS that's in the museum, it's the same size as that one. Yeah, it's gonna be rocking for the whole ride up. So hold on. Yep. Here comes the animals. We're gonna be coming up to it over the bridge soon. Hold on. You might want to get good shots of the animals when it gets close. See, we're special. We get to see all the footage and uh, trains and stuff. We might meet up with two of the other ones. 482 and 481, half of the way. Those are the other two that left this morning. These are where we keep the speeder cars. Here it is. Here's the animus, folks. Since due to all the rain and stuff, we got more water. Hold on, this bridge is old fashioned one.
you know you can hang out a little bit if you want pictures you can hang out a little bit they said you can yeah if you just hang your head out a little if you want pictures just do that yeah once we get down the high line you'll see the whole river Everyone gets one on this train. Yeah, everyone gets a mug except for the ones up front. Because we're on luxury, that's what we are. Turn it a different way, so I don't care. I'm trying to get the animals. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm just videotaping the animals. Nah, I'm not worried about it. I don't worry about it. That's why I don't worry about it. Careful, there's soot flying right now because it's coming our way. That's why I'm wearing my soot protectors. I wish this track wasn't so old and rocky. I'm trying to hold the tripod and my cup. Do you mind holding it when I go get a drink? The tripod in case it falls? Thanks. It, it shouldn't, but it's, hold, it's down real tight. But if it does, just grab it. Please, thank you. You guys scared everyone off over here? 
th this is it. This is the load that we have. We're not even filled. Okay. That's all right. You guys have room to walk around then. I mean, I like yeah. it. Yeah. When does the concession open? Uh, we'll open in about 20 minutes. Good. Uh, I am back. I have DVDs and guidebooks, as well as some of the sunglasses if anyone is interested. Uh, just raise your hand if you guys would like something, and I'll make my way down the middle here and get you guys set up. So.
see some waterfalls along the way due to the snow melting. That tank creek is high. Timber middle up about the tim uh, tall timber, the route where we're going to stop for drop off people. But that's been demolished for years. I've been looking for it for years, but it's gone. Oh, we might be making a water stop along the way. And look, we got some speeder cars behind us, folks. From Durango to follow us to make sure everything's going okay. The route I don't know as much as I used to know. I'm trying to figure it out. You made it. Yeah. Here you go.
<laughs> hey, what are you doing? <laughs> we caught you. <laughs> if you're looking for gold, there's no gold. It's silver. Did you know? It's silver ore that's in there. It's not gold. Just hold on. We'll be going in one minute. Are we getting water or what? Oh, we're letting people off for the hikers, I guess. Oh, we're not? Something must be going wrong with 473. There's a water tower right there. Oh, there is? Okay, good. Yeah, she's a... Mining. 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 That's a speeder car. It's called. There. Oh well, yeah, we are in the house. That's where we're at. Because we go up a lot of grades going in. Because Silverton's higher up than us that we're at right now. I know there's a K-27 out there, 464. That's a, this is that's what the last train is. It's 464 train out. But there's a real steamer called 464, a K-27 of the DRGW that's up in oh, Michigan. Kind of walk through that was crazy. Remember that? Remember that old house in Ashford? We had that sideways. Yeah. Find any silver out there? Yeah, I remember that crazy thing. It's gold. Silver, I thought so. I thought it was silver. Coins. coins, yeah, that's good. She found silver coins out there. She can become rich with all that stuff that's in the water. I don't know that much. She lives up here. She's rich anyway. Yeah, really. Can afford to live here? Yeah, it is. Good. <laughs> she found one. She said, "She got it. She showed it to us when you weren't looking. She showed it, and it's silver. It's actual good, good silver." Silver? Yep, it's silver because there's silver ore in the water. She found one already. Yeah, I, see, uh, I couldn't hear. Her, yeah, she that. found one because she has a metal detector to check. Yeah, That's it. what she said. She even showed it. Yeah, I know. I see it. Yeah. I, I couldn't hear y'all talking. It's too hot. It is hot. It is hot. Yeah, in the sun it will be hot for a while. But when we turn on the high line, the sun will disappear. <clears throat> Yeah, we're going up about 4% grade. Getting water already. Yeah, you'll see on the bridge, the highlight. Have to get more? Wow. I guess at every convenient spot they have to get water. Yeah. I know they're fixing stuff. We just waited and walked down there there. Some silver. She found silver already in the water. Because there's only silver in here, not gold. <laughs> She's going to be a millionaire, millionaire when she finds all of it. Because those things are worth one million bucks in the today's world. If you find it and stuff, it's worth that much. Just keep going this way, Don't take a right or a left. <laughs> Makes a good picture. Yeah, we're just about to pick up the water spout now. It's right next to this lab, man. <laughs> I don't know, 
got you for a birthday. She got it in good hand. Yeah, for a million bucks. Yeah. Aren't you a little water? Much more wise. Did you call? Yeah, we called. Look, you know what? We had we had some friends that had come up here from Denver before, and they they gave us some advice. Yeah, so that, that was really good. Yeah, well, until I turned sixty-five. Were you interested? And then uh, yeah, I was asked. We were trying to build you a package. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, they were real. I enjoy talking to them on the phone, and I usually don't. I usually don't like yeah, yeah. like talking to people on the phone. Another good thing to do is you go straight to somebody. You know, push one, push three. Push yeah, four. automated system. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Well, yeah. so, I thought I heard this. Yeah. 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 Just give me somebody with a heartbeat. I was looking for a, a water pump for my washer. Not to mention that. Yeah. Well, they, they just kept going up on our bill without even knowing. No, no, no. You know, I told them to start getting it. Yeah, and then I said, well, you know, we're going to deal with it. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. But we're still going to be charged for this additional. When is it going to end? Yeah. Well, they came to the house one time and she was there. And they, they said, we've noticed that you have a. Or you don't have enough filters or whatever it was you have on there. You that you're not for. And, uh, we're going to have to start charging you for it. Or we're going to have to cut the third of Cut it off. Get out this way. Let me get you on ladder. Well, wait a minute, man. Wait a minute. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they started backpedaling. <laughs> <laughs> I got a ladder. You know, when the guy came out and he hooked it up, you can't help it if you put those services on there. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I lined them out real quick. Yeah. <laughs> And they didn't come back. So you want to turn it off? Go ahead. I don't care. That's what. I'm going to put this picture in. Is there empty seats back here? All there's, a few, there's a few on this other side. Yes, sir. Yes, yeah. Sir. Hey, go for it. She's a, uh, go for it. She's a minor. Right there. Except we're in here. Yeah. yeah, you got it? I think I got her in the picture here. We got a we got a know it all on our train though. Oh, that's a winer down here. Yeah. <laughs> so gaily. Oh. Okay. okay. She said she found a coin a while ago, a silver coin. Worth a million dollars. We, we, we were hollering at her.
They probably don't even know what a cottonwood tree is. Yeah, they're, they're up here. I haven't seen any. There you go. I don't know what they're I would assume it means get ready when it gets more. I should have forked out $10 and got that wood. Well, to get it, what are we going to do with the wood? Do we get thrown away? I could find out what the whistles mean. <laughs> Don't look it up online. Two, two whistles mean we're getting ready to get apart. Except for Steve. You're That's what we're doing. Everybody wants our car. Yeah. <laughs> yep, everyone wants our car. Yeah. It's beautiful back here. Yeah, we feel the same car. River won't be coming up for another while. We follow it pretty much all the way. We ha halfway we do, yeah, and then we, once we get on the High Line, we'll follow it all the way in. Right, right. There's 473. If you want your picture. Oh look, there's more speeder cars coming. We got two more coming, speeder cars. Holy cow! Yee-ha! Hold on, wait till we turn around. picture get it now before we lose it. A four can be three. So this once we turn again we won't see it for a while. That's really deep for a Yeah it's part a little lake I think for fishing. You just missed the engine to get your shot if you wanted to get 473. Because we won't be passing it, seeing it for a while. Yeah, you can see it on this side if you stand on that side. Hey, I take pictures with the smoke all the time. Trust me, and I love it. Great. 
Now we're leaving the road behind, so the rest is the high line. Okay. 